And welcome back on Take Action News with David Schuster, this is executive producer Daniel Marins in the host chair this hour on Saturday, May 4th. We've been promoting and playing up this moment for all of the show, and of course that is we're having a great debate on the issue of abortion rights and reproductive rights. We are pleased right now to have joining us on the phone Lila Rose, the director of Live Action, debating on behalf uh, against abortion rights, and Aaron Matson, the editor-at-large of RH Reality Check. Lila and Aaron, thank you so much for joining us. Okay. Well, we are uh, we are making sure that we're getting Lila and Aaron on the line, but uh, at th- the reason that we decided to have this debate at this very moment is the ongoing trial of Dr. Kermit Gosnell, who was an abortion doctor in the city of Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, and basically is, is now being charged with multiple counts of, of first-degree murder for, for performing abortions on, on viable fetuses, viable babies after they had emerged, and in, or, or rather, in, in, I should say, killing them, not a normal abortion and also being guilty of manslaughter of a woman who was in his care. There, there uh, Many of the assistants that worked there, including a medical student who was not properly licensed, have apparently agreed to plea deals. Three of the first-degree murder charges, it was recently announced, were dropped. He was acquitted of those. He still stands accused of many other violations. And, of course, the folks in, these, in the what they call the pro-life community, um, what I think objectively we can say is the anti-abortion, commu- anti-abortion rights community, believe that this is, this should be the, uh, this should, is, is a watershed moment to make Americans more aware of practices that occur all across the country in abortion clinics. On the other side, pro-choice activists, those who advocate in favor of abortion rights, believe that, that this is actually further evidence that that abortion needs to be out in the open and as available as possible so that pe- doctors like Dr. Gosnell uh, don't, aren't allowed to thrive into practice. Uh, 